Should I start? I don't know anything to roast him about because you're, you're like that fabulous lady, the fantastic Give me the in the neighborhood. Oh, what do we do? I, how do you roast somebody that knows how to do it all? I don't know how that happens. So, would anybody like to come up and take the mic? You're so old. That when you light your candles on your birthday cake, it, ca it causes global warming. My best, 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 best girlfriend. Wow. Yes. Yeah. 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 High school. Back in the day. Oh, she's gonna tear it up. No. She's, she, she'll, she'll be out here for about an hour. Oh my god, do I have to stand here? <laughs> no, you can sit. <laughs> okay. You guys know Luigi for how long? Like recently? Like last 20 years? 29 years. Okay. <laughs> well, she has not been easy. Not been easy. Oh, put your mouth to the mic. Going to school. Um, I came to this country in 1984. She was my first friend, only friend in school, best friend. Um, 
and we did some stuff in school. And Luigi was the silent killer because she was the one that always did stuff and I got blamed for it. Um, AKA every day after school, like, you know, lunchtime and all that stuff, we go to get on the escalator and I'm in front of Luigi and the guys would look back at me and like, all the while she was squeezing their butt. And I'm a, I'm the dumbass. I'm the one laughing when they look back because I don't know what's going on. Why are you looking at me? I'm smiling. She squeezed their butt and I'm caught. Like, I'm busted. Like, so, oh yeah. So it went, we actually squeezed everybody, including the principal's butt. It was kind of, it was kind of, yeah, that was a lunch. It was a, they, they knew because every time they saw me and her, they like, Run. So we were feeling butts all the way. Good thing it ain't today because we get arrested. Right, right, right. Uh, we go through high school. Um, then we go, she starts working at legal. She wants me to work to be a waitress. No, can't do it. So I became a hostess. Okay. After work, we go out, party, well, hang out and stuff like that. And there was this one night that Luigi, all, full of energy, always had energy. We decided um, we're going to leave. We went hanging out. We get in the car. I'm taking her home. Yeah. Uh-huh. <laughs> and we go buy a half gallon of liquor. Yeah, I told you, you wanted me up here. I'm getting <laughs> So we're coming down Morton Street and we get by the police station and she said red light and she's like anytime she wanted me to do something wrong she always called me Jay. <laughs> so I'm at the red light and I hear Jay and I'm like what the hell and she's like run the red <laughs> so I look at her are you off the damn mind? Like, run the red? Are you crazy? Be in front of a police station. Like, how the hell am I gonna run it? She's like, run the red. I'm like, no! She's like, I dare you. I'm like, what? She's like, I double dare you. So, dumbass I was, I floored it. And all of a sudden, I heard, She's saying that now, and she's like, Jay, don't worry about it. I'm cussing her out. And she's like, Jay, Jay, I'll pay the ticket. I'll pay the ticket. Don't worry about it. And I'm like, just shut the hell up. Just shut up. Shut up. Mind you, we have a half gallon in the back. So we pull over, I pull over, they come up, two black cops, one on the left, up on the left, one on the right. And I'm like, just shut up. So he comes up, he's like, ma'am. You sat there at the light for like two minutes. Why would you possibly, like, why would you ever run the light after sitting there that long? I'm like, well, um, I got bronchitis and I was coughing and I had some, like, cough drops down in the in my bag and I was trying to get them. And my sister said the, the light and I thought she meant it was green, so I hit the gas. She was like, oh, well, I knew they had to be a logical explanation. All of a sudden, this idiot is going to come to the other cop. Yo, you want to come and go with us? Like, I'm like, but anyway, the next day I had, what was it? Tylenol, cold, and yeah, one of the cops brought all that stuff. Oh, but then it goes to these. Jay. Yeah. You gonna start my locks for me? Okay, no problem. First night she comes to the house, like around 10 or 11 o'clock. <laughs> and she sits down and I start to do the locks and She's twitching around and touching around and she's like falling asleep and I'm like, yo, Luigi, like, that. she's like, 
Yo, I got the weebie jeebies. The weebie jeebies. Yeah, the weebie jeebies. Can I go to sleep for like an hour? And that's how it went. Every time she came to my house. Actually, I think I stopped pulling off because of her. <laughs> Every time she wanted her locks done, that's what happened. She came late, then she had the weebie jeebies, <laughs> and then she fell asleep at like 3 o'clock in the morning, then she wakes up, and I'm finishing her locks. Hated it. But... <laughs> she's been there, she's been... My friend, my best friend, my only friend, and she's my son's godmother. I'm her daughter's, her first daughter's godmother, and she was my son's godmother. I lost him two years ago, and I love her to the moon and back. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. Yes. Yes.